going on YouTube it's just gonna be a quick little video um, just uh, seeing how many of you guys actually adjust your forks out there before I um, kind of had it a little screwed up I had seven lines showing on my uh, preload so I basically had no preload and I rode that shit all the way to Tampa like that I didn't even really realize it somebody suggested to have the preload backed out that far for um for a smoother you know ride but it it just really sucks for wheelies this is gonna end up fucking my uh fork seals up luckily they're they're still holding in there or hanging in there <laughs> right now i got four lines showing i tightened it in pretty good made it kind of stiff the compression i believe it's three clicks out from fully clockwise for the rebound i'm not exactly sure what i have that on i know i have it almost all the way in it's probably about two or three clicks out just like the, the compression is but yeah let me know what you guys have your setup as i'm just curious to find out you know any of you guys out there with a the zx6r with similar forks i mean they're all almost the same um the 04 has the these little knobs up here the newer ones just have two screws on the top and one on the bottom I'm trying to find the best wheelie setup I just got this uh, Shinko rear tire, it's a Shinko 009 Raven, um, this bitch is pretty nice, I'm liking it, um, it's more like flattened out compared to the most of the sporty tires, so you have more contact, you can actually kind of see it, how much contact it gets. But I did just hit some corners, so that could be the corners too. It wears down fairly even. Like if you don't really have a lot of corners where you live and you're always getting flat spots in your tire, but the sides are still good. Chicken strips. Chicken strips. Um, then you might want to look into these. Especially if you're not really crazy with cornering. So, and I like to have a tire that lasts long because it sucks having to replace them every like thousand or two thousand miles just because it's fucking flat in the middle the front i never really have any problems with you can get whatever you want for the front um this one's got a pirelli which is almost done it's it's getting there like barely any tray left so either this coming paycheck or the next i gotta get a new front so and i'm probably just gonna get a shinko for the front because they're like i don't know they're probably like 70 80 bucks um, and you can get them really cheap off the internet too. My buddy Cowie Bunga 636 recommended that. So figured I'd let you guys know what I got, how it's working. Um, but yeah, let's go for a little ride. I'm gonna do some wheelies and shit. Probably hit some corners or something like that. Yeah, the, I can definitely tell a difference with my front forks. Um, it's more bumpy, but you're really not gonna get it much better. No matter how loose you make it, it's just gonna fuck. It's just gonna fuck everything up. Cause that's what it happened. That's what happened to me. I, I I tried loosening it with the impression that it would um make for a softer ride, not as bumpy, but it just it's still fucked. Damn it, man. Come on, fuck. Love, brother. 